Perry Township School Libraries are very fortunate to have access to ebooks and audiobooks through Follett Destiny, which is our library management system. To access the school library ebooks and audiobooks, go to the Ta Perry Township resource portal, scroll down to Quick Links, select School Libraries. Then pick your library, your school's library. And then in the upper right hand corner, you want to log in. You want to log in using your Google account. And this will link to your school account using your school ID and password. And you do have to give it permission to link to Follett, which is the company that owns Destiny. So now we're going to go to catalog because we want to get a book. And Destiny Discover is one way that we can search for an ebook. You can search in the search bar here and find a book. And you'll have to have, find one that says ebook on it. That's one way that you can find. You also have different filters over here. You can search by a Lexile. You can search by reading counts books and uh, levels. But I'm going to show you how to use one of these books. There's open book. That's just like taking it off the shelf and taking a look at it. And then there's actual checkout where it goes into your account. So I am going to go ahead and open this book. Now I can look at these books in a different way. I can look at them one page at a time or two pages like a traditional book. I have some controls in the upper right hand corner of how to do that. Over here, display options. If I click on that, it'll allow me to look at it as one page or dual pages. I can look at it with different coloring of the screen, whatever is most pleasing to your eyes. I can change the font size as well. Another thing I can do over here is I can jump into the book wherever I want to. Maybe I want to go back to the title page. If I want to go to the table of contents, I can see how many chapters and I can jump into any of those chapters at any time. I can also jump into the chapters here. Now, let's decide if I decide that I want to check it out, I can go ahead now and check out the book and it'll tell me when it's due. I can also have it read it to me. And I can um, have different audio options about slower or faster and what kind of a voice, a female vo voice or a male voice. Chapter 2. So this should be reading to you right now. Dropping fast. And between that and the rain, my fingers are I shaking. Make it slower if I wanted to. Chapter 2. The temperature is dropping fast. And between that and the rain, my... I can bookmark this page. And then when I come back in, I have to add the bookmark. And it'll say that it's on this page. And then I can close the book. Another way I can look for books is I can just browse. These are all ebooks, and I could see all of them and just look through them that way. If I wasn't sure what I wanted, it'd be just like going to the shelf and looking around at covers of books. Or I could go to the audiobooks and I could see all as well. And we have a lot of different varieties and lexiles and interests of books. So you can kind of go down and take a look at different ones. You can also uh, limit your search here by the format. 
ebook, and then I could limit it to reading counts, and I could set my options then when I search as well. I could find all the Who Was books. I can come over here and I can see my checkouts. And it'll show all your hard copy checkouts. If it has a little red icon with a book, that means it's a book. If it has a little green E, it means it's an ebook. And I can even return it early if I'm done with it. If I need to download a book on my Chromebook because my internet is not reliable, I will first have to check out the book while I am connected to the internet. So I'm going to use this example who was Booker T. Washington and check it out. And then I'm going to open the book. Okay, so now I'm in online mode. I am connected to the internet. What I want to do now is to have offline access. So I will download it now and it will go onto my Chromebook. So now I can go into Offline Content Library, and there is my book when I need to access it the next time. To access an audiobook, I can just browse in my audiobooks, or there's search options. I can choose Format and choose Audiobook. And then I can search by title. So I'm going to choose this book about Gandhi and I'm going to check it out. And that way I have it for a period of time and then I can play it to actually hear it. I can play my audiobook with the play button. And then up in the upper right hand corner, there are controllers that will help uh, give me other options. Like I can return the book early and it will tell me when it's due. I can change the speed of the talking. I can change the speed of the talking. I can bookmark where I am in the book. I can go to a different track or a different chapter number. Contact one of the Perry Township Schools school librarians for more information about using Destiny ebooks or audiobooks.